previously on Minecraft Story Mode. The world can be a very scary place. Villains can be larger than life. And almost impossible to defeat. The stress of saving the world can turn even the best of friends against each other. And not everyone will be on your side. Some will try to take advantage of your kindness. But a true hero will know exactly what to do. And will inspire others to do the same. Scariest thing of all, even for the bravest hero, is discovering the villain is much closer than you think. Petra's okay wearing it. I gotta get back. Find the admin. Find my friends. The guest will kindly follow the orange line in the floor to the check-in zone. The guest will kindly follow the orange line in the floor to the check-in zone. Ahem. Ahem. Throat clearing sound. The guest will kindly the follow the orange line to the, the check in zone. Yeah, I heard you. The guest will kindly follow the orange line in the floor to the check in zone, or else they get the lava. The lava, the lava, the lava. Jeez, got it. We made. line. At Rock, the admin said, a place where I'd never see the light of day again. What is this place? Reformatory for people the admin has found difficult. I'll be your warden. So, the admin created this nut hut too, huh? Of course. The admin is an endless source of building brilliance, including this beautiful behavioral adjustment retreat center. So, it's a prison. Hey, no, no, we don't use the P word here. But it is a prison. Let's not challenge authority. The admin doesn't let us use that word, so we don't use that word. Understand? You know he's not here right now, right? 
You never know. I need to get back. The admin put his gauntlet on one of them. Who knows what he's making them do? He gave them the gauntlet? Oh, man, lucky them. That means they're the admin's favorite. <laughs> How great would that be? I bet your friend is living it up. Enjoying the high life right by the admin's side. Great? More like stressful. Dangerous. No two ways around it. It straight up stinks. That's exactly the kind of attitude that got you sent here. And if your friends are anything like you, they'll be making their journey to Betterment right next to you, I'm sure. Now hang on a tick. I have a, another guest on my manifest. Male, grizzled beard. Hair is described as majestic. Long... Long list of aliases hey, distract here. Distract him. Yeah, that's Jack. Oh, Jesse, thank goodness I found you. This I place know. is. Let's get out of here. Wait, you can't. It's too dangerous. Stop them, associates! Believe what a mess we're in. And all because I didn't realize Foss was actually the admin. Oh, what a mess. Manipulated, shammed, ashamed. Hey, the admin fooled everyone, not just you. But I should have known. I should have been better. And now the admin has Petra too. I, I don't know how we're gonna get out of this one. Hey, sound the alarm! We don't stand a chance without weapons. Can we run? Where? Wherever they aren't. Stop them! Don't let them reach the burrows! Where we are. What is that? Whoa! Great! More weird monsters. Are those zombies? I had that gauntlet right about now. Yeah, maybe not this way. Whoa! What are those things? Spider? A creeper? It's the stuff nightmares are made of. That is unsettling. 
course. Why would there only be one? There's never just one. Oh no, oh no, oh no. in an escape attempt. <sighs> that is just... That is just rude. Take this one to the mushroom. <laughs> and bring that one to my office. Now. Close the door, would you? Do as you're told. Close it yourself. Fine. Be defiant. Oh, large Henry. <laughs> Defiant. <sighs> Disappointing. Looks like I'll have to keep an extra eye on you and your crew. My crew? Oh. Let me show you. <gasps> Radar! Nerm! You see, here at the Sunshine Institute, there are two types of guests. People who make the admin extra angry, such as yourself, and your punch-happy friend down there. And there are people who the admin sends to make sure the first group will be, uh, well-behaved. Your friend, with the glasses, is surprisingly feisty for such a skinny guy. If you know what's good for you, Warden, you'll let them go. Oh, I'm sorry, but threats? definitely fall under the category of not well-behaved. Bring up Jesse's leverage, would you? Skinny guy, glasses? Funny story. When I first got here, I was actually part of the second group. We were just a crazy couple of griefers. Simpler times. No, 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 no this place is filthy! Ah, oh, so disorganized! Ah. Making me crazy. Jesse! Oh, I'm so glad you're okay. I was so look, I was so worried. Glad I'm okay? I'm just relieved that you're okay. Oh, you were worried about me? Meet the Iron Breath Taker. Iron bars to hold the victim in place below. Sticky piston above to shove an iron block down over their head. <gasps> Gulp! <laughs> now, 
I said before that you could follow in my footsteps. That could start now. Ready to improve that pesky bad behavior of yours and join the good guys? Work for me as an associate and help bring order to these poor, chaotic individuals. Don't do it, Jesse! <laughs> <laughs> What's it gonna be? Okay, I'll do it. Just stop. Oh, that's so great to hear. Hi. Hi, that was so dark. Easy, easy there. Radar, was it? You just had quite the harrowing experience. But don't worry. Our newest guard, er, associate, will be walking you out. Jesse, no. I don't know how much more of this I can take. <laughs> don't look at me like that. I did this for you, Radar. I'm trying to protect you. But, no. Well, well, well. Jesse, Jesse, Jesse. Stella. What a. How. Well, I appreciate you letting me out of that ice. I can't let that disrupt the new professional relationship we have now, okay? I'm sure you understand. I knew a day of reckoning would come for my rival. Ah, oh, you two know each other? <laughs> yeah, still not your rival. Never was, never will be. Careful, Warden. This one's crafty with the mind games. Now come on, Jesse. No one wants a sour rival. Be like me. I'm a shining example of success. I've barely arrived and I'm already bossing you around. <laughs> Isn't it grand? Let's go, Randall. It's Radar! Uh, that's what I said. <sighs> Stella's right. Commitment and loyalty to the admin's cause are cornerstones around here. The more friends stick together, the harder they make it for each other. So maybe... readjust your concerns. Jeez. Have you always been like this? Always? <laughs> no. What are you hiding, Warden? Not every prisoner here wears orange, Jesse. Let's go, rival! That's right! Go along, Jesse, to the mushroom! Exactly what I was going to suggest. I'll have your job before you know it, Warden. Be careful what you wish for, Stella. Show them around, would ya? Thanks. Excuse me? <laughs> Who are you supposed to be? We don't have a problem, do we? I need a moment to process. You have to watch your back with her. She's ruthless. Ta-ta, Jesse! I'll be at my post supervising a more impressive cell block. Don't be too jealous. Or do. I wouldn't blame you. <sighs> you okay, Radar? Wish I was. I need something to eat. Get my strength back. You're in the right place. Guests make mushroom stew here. Guess I just need some mushrooms then. Here's one. Mushroom! I'm gonna starve. Waste away. Poof. No more radar. I'll find some food for you. Just rest. Resting. Thanks, Jesse. So, biting over a tiny handful of mushrooms is the only way they can eat? Mm -hmm. Yep. Do guards get cookies? 
Okay, look. I thought you knew. The guards have a delicate supply of ingredients, none of which are approved by the Take warden. these cocoa beans. I don't have any wheat for you, but I can tell you who does. That pal of Gruesome can set you up with the wheat. He's my source. Where does he get the wheat? Nobody knows. But he's got his reasons, I guess. Look, just put the screws to him. He's a guest, and you're an associate. He'll play ball. Hey there, guard friend. You just caught me putting a happy little finishing touches on my happy little painting here. What, uh, what you painting? I'd so love to paint a happy little mushroom, but none ever stick around long enough for me to paint. I know that you guards don't usually help little old me, but could you build me a happy little mushroom to paint? Here's some wonderful dirt for you to use. If it's not too much trouble after all. Is just that is just lovely. Thank you ever, ever so much. Please, you must share your thoughts on my work so far. Don't you hold back now. Honesty's the best policy. Oh my gosh, it's great. The uh chiaroscuro is just impeccable, <laughs> truly. So happy you like it. And now. I like you. You'll be spared when the bad thoughts come. Hey, are you busting out of here? What? No, of course not. I never do that. It's my associate friend again. Hey, can I ask you some questions? Oh, um, I'm really busy right now. As the associate walked up to Brick, she noticed that the lowly prisoner was narrating all her actions. Uh, yeah. Hi, I'm... The associate didn't have to introduce herself. Brick knew all about the associate named Jesse. The... Jesse was surprised to learn that the reputation of the Wither Slayer, the leader of the Order of the Stone, had spread so far. Brick was curious what Jesse thought of someone who narrated every action around himself. Brick waited for Jesse to say something. Jesse approved of Brick and his quirks. Jesse winked with approval. Like this. Brick was happy for the approval, but didn't appreciate Jesse stealing his thing. I mean, come on. It was his thing first. So, what are you in here for? Brick remembered the day the admin, annoyed with Brick's constant need to narrate, sent him to the Sunshine Institute to break Brick of the habit. Brick was promised release if he stopped, but nothing will ever break Brick's spirit. He will narrate forever. That's it for now. Thanks, Brick. You're welcome. Uh, Brick told Jesse, you're welcome.
So, um, I hear you might have some wheat. I need two of them. I don't know who you've been talking to, but it ain't true. Wheat is considered contraband in this facility. You know how things work around here. I'm an associate. You're a guest. Oh, you're gonna play that part, are you? Uh, you better remember this. I want special treatment from now on. Yeah. Yeah. Hey, come here. Wheat and cocoa beans. All yours, Jesse. No way! I've been down here for too long. I can't stand another second! Whoa. Nothing personal. I'm just mega, mega hungry. <laughs> Give me that. I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. I'm just so hungry. Uh, <clears throat> hello? What's going on in here? Jesse? I expect far better from my associates than this. When Cookie's not that big of a deal, when Cookie's not that big of a deal. And just who does this contraband belong to, hmm? <laughs> you all know that weapons are strictly forbidden at the Sunshine Institute. So who does this belong to? You might as well just come out and tell me. Sure, if you call a wooden sword a weapon. Hey! Do you know how hard it was to steal all that wood? I mean, uh, oops. All weapons are forbidden, no matter how arguably useless they are. You know that misbehavior means getting sent down a level. And that means... No! Not the zombie mines! Not the zombie mines! Yes. Perhaps a little time harvesting rotten flesh will teach you something. Take him away. Well done, Associate. You've successfully apprehended your first contraband. Keep up the good work. At least now I can make a cookie for Radar. I hope you're learning how to be a cooperative champion. Wait, what? Is that the admin? You are all here to be reminded of your potential. It's a recording? Come on. And I hope you'll see it in yourself, as I do. Because if you don't, well, we'll cross that bridge when we come to it, eh? In the meantime, demonstrate your cooperative potential, and you just may become the ultimate champion! It's not much. Hello, Hopefully it'll help Radar associates. get his strength back. Admin here with a reminder. Helping others will only drag you down. Here, Losers eat this. Get lose. your strength back. Say it with me now. Losers thanks, Jesse. I really appreciate... Uh, right. Yeah, I'm sure, thanks, whatever. Good day. Interesting attitude there, buddy. I'm gonna have to really step it up. I mean, this is prison. So from now on... I'm prison radar. I'm gonna get my own mushrooms. Make my own stew. Disregard my bedtime. Hey, that's the spirit radar? You look awesome. Really? Thanks. Find that out there. Good day! Now, get out of here, guard! It's time for Prison Radar to show this world what he's made of! That's right! Come at me, dude! What's going on? Prisoner X has escaped! I repeat, Prisoner X has escaped! All guests, please report to the nearest lounge. <laughs> Think that's their cute way of saying so. Yep, you should get in one too. You haven't had your protocol X training yet. 
get it. This place just keeps getting weirder and weirder. Prisoner X? Other inmates were talking about her. Something of an infamous escape artist. Rumor has it she even knows the way through that maze. Most people have never even seen her, the Keeper locked up so deep. That sounds like the sort of person we should get on our side. Agreed. Someone with that kind of knowledge could be very useful. But where is she exactly? She's apparently locked up on the deepest, darkest level of this place. Cell Block X. Detecting a theme with the names. Yeah, they found their groove and they're sticking with it. We need to get to Cell Block X. That warden seems to have taken a shine to you. Might not be a bad idea to work your way up. In the meantime, get on his good side. Could be useful. Or a disaster. But hey, only one way to find out, right? Okay, it's a plan. You stay here and rest up. I'm gonna find a way to get us to Cell Block X. Sounds good. While you do that, I'm gonna study this place. Before we're through, I'll know it like the back of my hand. But how to get promoted? Hmm. That Oxblood guy sure looks suspicious. If I can catch him doing something against the rules, maybe I can get promoted. Secret buttons! Nice! Now we're on to something. Now, the question is... What do they do? Starting to get the feeling these wool blocks are hiding something interesting. Ugh. Let's see what I can do with this. I think there's another room back there. Okay. Time to see what tall, red, and gruesome is hiding. This moves those blocks. Got it. Looks like the buttons move the blocks. So that button moves that block. If only someone had been around to see me being this impressive. Hmm. Uh. A mushroom? Uh. What the heck are you doing here? Sounded me like I could ask you the same question. Yeah. Uh. Mind explaining what you're doing in my most private of spaces? Visitors ain't welcome, and you are most definitely a visitor. Just looking for Cell Block X, big guy? Well, it ain't here, Short Stack. If you hadn't noticed, you left the hole open. Now get out of my cell before you regret getting in it. Did I hear mooing? Oh, come on! Excellent work, new associate. You see, this is how you get promoted. Work your way up. But first, to maintain order. This creature cannot be allowed to undo the balance of the mushroom. You shear it, uh, would you, Jesse? But then it'll be... An ordinary cow, yes. You know, bringing back the balance of the mushroom. Thought that was obvious. What? No! Don't do it, Jesse! Not liking your hesitation here, Jesse. You can't. You won't. You do want to be promoted, don't you? Ain't happening, Warden. Deal with it. I'm ordering you! No! Deal with it! 
Take it away! No! Not my Jeffy Poo! <laughs> I trusted you, Jesse. You are no longer an associate. You've been demoted to guest. And as a consequence for your actions, dig it up. What the heck are you doing? Teaching you a lesson, Jesse. No more mycelium. I'll starve. You and your friends will be relocated to the lower levels. The zombie mines. Well, isn't this a treat? My rambunctious rival is now my poor prisoner. Get moving. Well, we needed to go to the lower levels anyway. Let's hope they're survivable. Welcome to the zombie mines, Jesse. <laughs> Just when you think you've seen it all. What exactly is this place? Every few minutes, a million gross zombies spawn. The equally gross prisoners dispatch them and collect the zombie flesh, which is... Gross. I get it. But why? Don't know. Don't care. Do your job. Zombies won't fight themselves, so get to fighting. That is sadistic. No two ways around it. Yeah, but it's how the place works. Survival of the fittest and all that. Though survival of the grossest is more accurate here. You brought this on yourself, Jesse. I don't get it. You could have just joined the admin and never had to suffer a second. Instead, you chose to throw it all in the lava pit. I think all of those people cheering for you 24-7 have made you delusional. Made you think that you can just uh, change the world. <laughs> It's sad is what it is. I'm a rebel. It's just who I am. So it would seem. But consider this a warning. Don't mess with the admin. You will not like the outcome. I'll give you one piece of advice. Just one. Try not to cause any more trouble. If you do, you'll get sent to Maximum. With her. Who's in there? You must have heard those alarms earlier. That was Prisoner X. She tried to escape, but they got her back. And she, she scares me. You don't want to end up in there. So play nice. Come along, Luna. What on earth was that about? Sounds like that vent is our way to Prisoner X. Anything? <sighs> Nothing of use. Especially since I refuse to look away from those zombie spawners. Don't want any surprises when they go off. Hey. Keep your eyes open. Hey, what is this? Oh, the big guy, Oxblood. He's down for a while and headbutted the wall? Not sure why. But man, he has a hard head. We just haven't fixed it yet. There's redstone behind the wall. Hmm. I wonder what it connects to. There's gotta be a way in, but this door won't budge. Hey, don't even bother trying to get in. See those item frames? Only the admin and the warden have the right items. And they could be anything. Besides, why would you want into Prisoner X's cell? That's just bonkers. Stay away. You know how certain things are your business? This ain't one of them. Well then, someone is salty. Hmm. So that redstone leads to this door. If I can bypass the redstone circuit, I can open the door. 
Hey, guys! Over here! What did you find? We need to find something to bypass a redstone circuit and get this door open. This will lead us to Prisoner X. She can help us get out of here for good. Hey! Jesse! Stop loafing around! Well, there is someone in here who came from the outside who may still have a hefty inventory. <sighs> Stella. You know, Jesse, guests and associates really shouldn't be mingling. Yeah, about that. I need your help. I need to make a lever. Pronto? Why, exactly? Not that I, you know, really care. You want the truth? I'm trying to escape. As much as I admire you actually telling the truth, there's not a creeper's chance in a cat pack. Not helping you here. No, not risking angering the admin. I had to really prove myself to get this gig as it is. He's just using you. How can you not see that? No, uh, it's, uh, mutual. We're, you know, using each other. I think. Maybe you make some good points, but not enough of them. I have a place here. Respect. Um, you know, and power, and the, yeah, the works. It's actually very prestigious. Many, many people would love to have this position. Yeah, but what about Champion City? You're gonna abandon them? <laughs> Absolutely not. They'll be fine. They will be just... Oh, yeah, who am I kidding? I've done so much for them in the past, I mean, they can barely make bread without me supervising. Okay, look, maybe this isn't my dream destination. This place is horrible, and I am worried I will never get the smell out of my hair. Here's the cobblestone and stick. But you need to get me out of here. I know we've had our issues, but I also know that you're a hero or whatever. <sighs> sure, Stella. We'd be happy to have you. If you're happy, I'm happy. No matter how many worlds I see, it always seems to come back to levers. Okay, let's do this. Zombie wave incoming! Prepare yourself! Surprised. 
Cadman. It's not enough that you disregarded all the rules in my icy palace of doom, tried to upset the delicate order of the Sunshine Institute. Now you're trying to disrupt the therapeutic benefits of my zombie mine? What gives? Pretty sure your fellow inmates were just trying to peacefully- Your stupid zombie minds were just the start, Admin. I'm busting out of this prison. Oh, you really think so, eh? <laughs> boy, oh boy, I can't wait to see that. Sir! I'm very disappointed in you, Warden. I, I'm just, I'm, uh, yeah, I'm just a nervous eater. I'm sorry. Ugh, no, not that. I'm disappointed that you couldn't keep Jesse in line for one measly day. I was just trying to do my job, and now I'm in trouble because of you. This job isn't easy to begin with. Why do you have to go and make it harder? Oh, for the love of... Enough! I'm through letting you disappoint me! And that goes for you, and you, and you, and especially you. And as for you... I've been looking for an opportunity for you to prove your loyalty. To prove your worth as my champion. I suggest you pull out your sword and attack Jesse. And as for you, Jesse, well, don't think I don't believe in fair play. <laughs> now we'll have some real fun. No! for you, Jesse. The highest of hopes. You could have been my champion. And you gave it all. No, I can't. This isn't happening. <laughs> Serious ouch. Zip it, Jesse. We only got one shot at this. I'm gonna go to the admin, and then we'll both attack him. Just trust me on this one. <laughs> You're joking, right? That's your big idea. Swords can't hurt me. Oh, all I asked you to do is fight your friend to the death, and you can't even do that. I don't even want you to be my friend anymore. And I don't want you to be my friend either. In fact, as far as I'm concerned, this whole place can burn to the ground. What about... Prisoner X, what about all of us? The Institute remains inescapable. So what do I care? I'm leaving. And I'm never thinking about any of you ever again. So I'll just be my own friend now. Can't dwell on the setbacks. Gotta keep looking forward. Did anyone else think that made him sound really lonely? <sighs> Oh, spare me the pity party. I don't need it. <sighs> I'm gonna have loads of friends soon. After all. Everyone loves Jesse. Right? No. <gasps> no way. You coming?
your back, Jesse. Trust me. I take care of Luna for me. Coming, darling admin! Stella, it's just the beginning. Your other friends will fall in line, too. Lucas, Axel, Olivia, all of them. Don't worry. I'll take good care of Beacon Town. Jesse, we gotta stop him! Uh, Petra! I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm so, 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 so sorry. What? No. You have nothing to apologize for. Let's hope Prisoner X is really our ticket out of here. So glad you're all right, Petra. Hmm. Yeah, that was... That was pretty bad. After he took me away, I, I was in this weird place. Time and everything was so strange. I felt like I'd been there forever, and I started to worry you'd given up on me. Hmm. Petra, are you crazy? We would never give up on you. Yeah, what Jesse said. Hey! Well, that's a nice thing for you to say. I saw Beacon Town, Jesse. They were all worried about you. No one knew where you were or if you were alive. I'm sure the admin's heading there right now. Wearing Jesse's mug to boot. It's freaking messed up, yo. It's true. Identity theft is no joke. The admin will wish he'd never seen my face when I'm done with him. No one wears my face except for me. We made it! Whoa. some intense security. Just stick close to Jesse, all right? Mm. We'll be fine. Don't worry. Yeah, you guys go on. Get Prisoner X. Huh. If I wanted to imprison the dreaded Prisoner X, that's where I'd do it. I think that's where we need to go. All we have to do is cross this conduit, reach the platform, jump down, and not die. Mm. Come on, I think we can make that jump. Ugh. You're up next, Nerm. Oh. Okay, now you learn. <laughs> Seriously. How do you do that? <laughs> Last jump! Jesse, you must be Prisoner X. <sighs> Bold of you to come here, not knowing who you're dealing with. I could shove you right into that lava, and you deserve it for being so trusting, so gullible. Just one little push. <laughs> and sizzle, sizzle, sizzle! 
Yeah, sorry to break it to you, but you're not scaring me. We're all locked up here. You're just another guest. Oh, I am so much more than that. So much more. Look, Prisoner X. Zara. You're supposed to know how to get out of here, right? What? Where did you get that idea? <sighs> no one's ever escaped the Sunshine Institute. I don't have time for lies, Zara. I need to get out of here. Oh, are we supposed to be friends now? <sighs> I don't owe you the truth. Or anything for that matter. The admin stole my identity and he's running around with my face doing horrible things in my name. I gotta get out of here now. Romeo was here? Just now? Uh, the admin was, but who's... Romeo. That's his real name. You didn't think admin was his given name, did you? That's funny. I call him Slimeball because that's what he is. And a jerk. He has that effect on people. It's true. You must really be something if you made him so mad. He almost never comes down here in person. Except to put the Warden's feet to the fire from time to time. Well, there is no more Warden. The admin fired him. That's fantastic. We won't have any trouble escaping with that little creep out of the picture. So now you want to help me? Any enemy of Romeo is a friend of mine, I always say. Well, I've never technically said that. How can I trust you know the way out? Oh, don't worry, I know the way. I'm the only one who does. If you know the way, then show me. Let's get out of here. Just one problem. This whole room is rigged to explode if I step one foot out of it. Explode? Take a look around. If someone doesn't stand on at least one of these pressure plates on the floor, these sticky pistons will retract. Lava meets TNT. And then the whole place blows up before you can say kaboom. <laughs> That's a stone pressure plate. That means I can't just use a block. Oh, it's fine. One of your silly companions can stay behind. The rest of us can go. That's the situation. Hey, you tricked us. You did this on purpose. Well, perhaps I did. But I couldn't be sure you'd agree to do this. Could I now? Oh. I hate to be a wet slime about all of this, but we have to get moving. I can't just leave them here. Then just leave one of them here. As long as one pressure plate is stood upon, the trap won't spring. So either the villager or the llama must remain behind. Hey. 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 No, no. You can't do that. Hey. Oh, come on. We seriously don't have time for this. I'm leaving. If you're interested in escaping the Sunshine Institute alive, I suggest you do the same. me to look after her. Come on, Luna. We gotta go. Oh. 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 I promise. We'll be back for you. Hey. Hey. How did you... My straight jacket? Oh, that was the easy part. If you're done with your tearful goodbyes, we have a prison to escape from. I presume? Yeah. Guys, this is Zara. Zara, the guys. Hello. Where, uh, where's Nerm? 
Oh, your villager friend offered to take my place so my cell's booby traps wouldn't go off. <gasps> what? No. He... he did that? And you let him? Nurm did it to save us. You would have been proud of him. I mean, of course I, I would have been. I... I always am. Oh. Well, no matter what it takes, no matter how many heads I have to clobber, I will get him back. She better be worth it. Trust me, I'm worth it. Can we get going, or is the reunion still underway? Yeah, we're going, we're going. Come on. Run for your lives! The guests have escaped their lounges! The warden's been fired! <laughs> Zombie meat is back on the menu! When I find that warden, I'm gonna make him pay for what he put me through! Yipes. Wouldn't want to be the warden right now. Every prisoner in this place wants to tear him to pieces. He better watch his back. And his front, and his side. Yeah, lots of watching in his future. Not my friend, not my problem. I'm moving on. Oh, all right. I never knew your heart had such icy tendencies, Jesse. Let's see if they left us any weapons. Weapons! Sweet, sweet weapons! I could take the enchanted iron sword, or the diamond sword with no enchantment. The diamond sword will last longer, but the iron sword is enchanted with sharpness. Not bad. Hmm. Okay. Definitely feeling better with a sword in my hand again. Agreed. What? It's versatile. I don't know much about llama fashion, but that's a good look, Luna. Looking good, gang. Now let's... E-O-F-F. That spells my best friend. <laughs> Love you, Jeffy. Friends reunited! It's a prison miracle! I guess Jesse does seem like good people. Oh, jeez. You're holding us up. Move along. Now. Rex, oh jeez, I don't want no trouble. I'm out of here! Come along, Jeffy! That was frighteningly effective. Well, now that that's over with, can we get moving now, please? Exercise. Plus, we beat up the warden. Win-win. Well, dip my bristles. Look who it is. It's my happy little friend who took a look at my happy little painting. Jesse, you free prisoner X? Just when I thought you couldn't ruin my life anymore. What in the world were you thinking? Holy crud! It's prisoner X. I think you've clearly lost your mind. I need her help, Warden. It's the only way to stop the admin. Did you know she was once an admin, too? The admin had to take her powers away. She tried to destroy him. I promised the admin I'd never let her free, no matter what. And I'll keep that promise. Even if I need to blow us all up to do it! <sighs> Lady 
Tay. me uncomfortable so is it true what he said about you you were an admin well ugh, it's complicated we want answers Zara ugh, fine yes I was an admin ages ago Romeo took my admin powers away from me just before he banished me to this pitiful prison but I'm not the villain here Romeo and his little warden were the ones who put you down here not me so glare in another direction! I'm innocent! I'm sick of secrets. You should have said something. I assumed you wouldn't take the news well, and how right I was. No more secrets. Fine. No more secrets. There's no way we can trust her now. Wait, so an admin can be stripped of their powers? Ugh, it's not simple, but yes. So what do we, we don't have time for this. It won't be long before Romeo finds out what's happened down here. Yeah, I guess we should keep moving. Follow me. I'm... I'm sorry, Jesse. But do you really trust her? She's not right in the head. Jack. You haven't seen what the admin can do. We need all the help we can get. But her? Really? Do you have any other ex-admins in your inventory? Petra's right. We need Zara's help. It's the only way. I just hope you're not making a serious mistake getting involved with another admin. Romeo did always love creating new nightmares at every opportunity. Yeah. They're all glowing! They're pretty scary looking, Jesse. Then let's be scarier. Crazy as a hopped up ocelot. 
Just let me think! Think, or make something up. Ugh! Come on, she didn't get lost on purpose. No, I didn't. Thanks, Jesse. Wait, we can just build to the top of the wall. And get to the other side that way. Yeah! Sounds good to me. was unbelievable and you stuck the landing nice oh that it's just my perfect reflexes and photographic muscle memory 
Well, there it is, guys. Our ticket out of here. That is sparkly. The sparkliest. Is that... Diamond? <laughs> Where is everyone? That lunatic is gonna be inventory if she's not careful. So? We should lend her a hand, shouldn't we? But she sounds like she's in trouble. We're not abandoning her. I told her I'd help her escape. Time to prove it. We can't just leave her. Come on! Oh, I can't believe we're doing this. get you out, didn't I? Now, show us the way. I know you didn't have to do that. I appreciate it. Let's go. I'm not a very trusting person. Romeo betrayed me. I have trouble getting along with others. I'm not much of a people person anymore. If I ever really was, it's gone now. We've all suffered because of the admin. And some have suffered much worse. There's something else you should know. There was a third admin named Fred. Where is he? Dead. He and I fought Romeo for control of the world. We lost. the rest of it? Yeah, how are we supposed to escape? This doesn't even go up that far. That's because we're not going up. We're going down. Down? There is no down. We're standing on bedrock. You can't go any lower. You might think so, but that's where we need to go. Below the bedrock. Everybody knows there's nothing under the bedrock except nothing. And also certain death. <sighs> we're not at the bottom of the world. It only appears that way. I'd rather take my chances in the maze than listen to any more of her lies. Any of you are welcome to join me. That's crazy talk. All those monsters- I don't care! She's an admin. An admin killed Voss, then stole his identity, and then- Remember I told you he took my admin powers away? Well, down there lies the secret to taking Romeo's powers from him forever. Fred, the third admin, discovered it. Jesse, help me dig through this tower. See? I told you! These stairs lead to our salvation! Now there is a good reason to get a move on. I can't let anyone run around disguised as me, or my friends. The amount of chaos they could cause is... Well, it's unthinkable. That's why I summoned you. Track them down. Make sure they're... behaving themselves. Oh, jeez. <laughs> run, 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 
Jesse. As fast as you can. <laughs>